party. For last six months, they've been saying Arvind Kejriwal will be arrested. Arvind Kejriwal will be arrested. You took out a whole campaign saying maybe Kejriwal. Then you asked people whether he should continue to be CM. The point is nobody arrested him. So where is the witch hunt if he's still not being arrested? Um, well, first of all, um, he's not arrested. No, all you viewers and all my co-panelists. Um, Honestly, at this point, um, isn't this absolutely clear that this is a clear case of political vendetta? I mean, these the two questions that were asked by the CM Irvin K. G. Valji, um, you know, as to whether what is the motive of these summons? I mean, whether he's been called, as my co-panelist earlier mentioned, as a witness or somebody who's an um, you know accomplice to the crime, a culprit. Um, this wasn't mentioned. This was a question that the ED could have answered. Um, the prior two summons, um, you know, these very questions were asked, but they weren't answered. And of course, the other, um, you know, the clear motive behind. I mean, it's apparent that the you know with such uh, less time uh, to the general election uh, this is something that um, i mean even the summons uh, issued before this were all but ma'am he was first called in november when there was plenty of time for general election now he'll be called six months later you are like i am waiting for the next election i'm going to go contest elections from andhra pradesh i'm going to contest elections in nagaland matlab kabhi na kabhi koi na koi election hota hi rahega aapka vendetta hi chalta rahega 365 din so, the last, the last time we just call Kiyata, it was well around the time of um, you know five states that were going. Sir, last, elections. madam, last month he was called. There was no election. He went for vipassana. It, now vipassana it, ka to vendetta nahi ho sakta na ki main aapka okay. aapka throat nahi clear hone dunga. Main itna vindictive ho chuka hu as ED. Well, well, this is the constitutional right of every citizen to inquire about the reason why he is not just a mere citizen. Um, no, he, he is, is a, a mere citizen. He's, he's a the chief, chief minister, minister of Delhi. But he is he still is a the citizen. Chief of Delhi. Exactly. Uh, this ED has clearly issued summons to all the leaders before him. Uh, by that, I mean uh, Manish Sisodia ji or uh, Sanjay Singh ji. And these, um, there was no clear money trail, the so-called money trail that was established. This case okay. has been Let's going go on back, Guru more Prakash, than to three things that, that Arvind Kejriwal has said. He has basically said, I've sent you two letters in the past. I'm asking you some basic questions, about five questions that he said. <laughs> the primary the among them was, in what capacity are you calling me? Are you calling me as a witness? Are you calling me as an accused? Are you going to arrest me? Are you saying some money has been found? There is no direct evidence found. ED hasn't got back to him. They keep sending him more and more notices. Is that the question? No, no, Padmita, I think I have a very simple and a pointed suggestion. I have a very simple, I have a very simple and a pointed suggestion to the Honorable Chief Minister of uh, Delhi, Mr. Arvind Kejriwal. So he has made certain amendments to the constitution of Aam Aadmi Party. I'm sure you are aware of it. So Mr. Arvind Kejriwal has declared himself as the permanent president of Aam Aadmi Party. I think he and his uh, volunteers should also sort of start a campaign to say that Arvind Kejriwal is above the constitution of India. Arvind Kejriwal Aam Aadmi Party ke samvidhan ke to upar hai hi. Arvind Kejriwal desh ke samvidhan ke bhi upar hai. Ki desh ka kanun un pe lagu nahi hota hai. The rule of law doesn't apply to Arvind Kejriwal. Only today, Padmaja, the departmental report and the vigilance inquiry has sufficiently stated and suggested that there is massive corruption going on the Mohalla clinic as well. Ek din mein char ghante jo doctor baitta hai, 240 minute wo doctor baitta hai aur 500 se adhik madhrizo ko dekhta hai. To Arvind Kejriwal ji ne Mohalla clinic mein aise koon se doctor ko bithaya hai jo aadhe minute mein do do patients ko dekh lete hai. Yeh mere samaj mein nahi aata hai. Arvind Kejriwal ji ne kaun se pathological lab ko engage kiya hai jahan pe corruption ka mamla samne aaya hai har jagah outsourcing har jagah jhoot bolna Mr Arvind Kejriwal you should accept this fact that you are an average citizen of country as well and as far as the protocol issue is concerned let me remind my friend from the Aam Aadmi Party Gujarat chief minister now the prime minister he went for the SIT questioning and sat there for 12 hours he had a state to run Gujarat to run but regardless of that, he had respected the rule of law of the country. Hmm. He had respected the institution of this country. But Mr. Arvind Kejriwal, now the people of Delhi and the people of India, they are aware of the fact that he has joined the same bandwagon as Mr. Dhirat Sahu, as Mr. Heman Soren, who said that he will get a chance to give 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 a chance. Arvind Kejriwal se zyada bada hypocrite bharat ki rajniti mein aaj tak nahi hua. Arvind Kejriwal is synonymous with hypocrisy. Arvind Kejriwal is synonymous with double standards. 
दोहरे मापदंड का दूसरा नाम अरविंद केजरीवाल ओके इफ मिस्टर मोदी कैन गो एस सी एम ऑफ गुजरात सो कैन मिस्टर केजरीवाल हुआ Um, well, I'd like to ask my respected BJP panelist. I mean, these so-called um, C- uh, CBI raids or ED summons that are being, uh, you know, issued time and again. I mean, have you actually looked at the figures uh, from 2004 to 2014? Only 112 raids were conducted, whereas from 2014 to 2022, there was. Uh, 3019 rates conducted and 95% of them mind you were on the opposition parties can we can the public not clearly see the political vendetta behind it isn't it apparent that these are politically motivated agencies that are clearly here just so, to cause madam uh, you know we had this we had this very generic me. argument okay just 30 seconds guru prakash respond because nobody actually addresses the very specific allegations that are being raised in very specific cases that the aam okay. aadmi party is facing all right about the conviction rate and raids guru prakash 